Hi there, and welcome to Kapow Wow English. Today we're going to look at contractions. So what does contraction mean? Well, contraction is when you shorten something, okay? So it could be a muscle. So when you have your arm out like this, this muscle here, the bicep, and you contract it, it gets shorter. Okay, so we're going to look at words which shorten. Okay, so let's have a look. So if we have this word, okay, so this word is they'll. Okay, so they'll. So you might have seen that word before. Well, what does that mean? Well, that means they will okay so that's why they'll is our a contraction because we've shortened it okay but because without it we've got these two separate words they will but we could say they'll okay so that is what contraction they'll so we'll leave that one there let's have a look at we'll leave that there so we can see it let's uh put this one now this is a contraction do you know what this contraction, what two words have we shortened there? Do you know? Your. It's you are. Okay? So that's why it's contraction, because we've shortened it by putting two words together, you and are, and shortening it and taking out the A, your. So you could say, you're an amazing friend, because I could have said, you are an amazing friend. Okay? So that's that one. Let's have another look at a contraction. This one, couldn't. Do you know what two words we have shortened to make couldn't? Do you know? You can see a root word. That means you can see part of the word. So the first word is could, okay, could. And the other one is could not. So you could say, I could not walk. Or you could say, I couldn't walk okay let's have a look at another one we have this one this is a popular one okay this is the word aisle yes do you know what so that's a contraction now this is a contraction because we've shortened it because the two other words that you could say instead of aisle are i will so you could say i will go to the gym tonight or you could contract that by saying, I'll go to the gym tonight, okay? Let's have a look at another one, okay? This is another popular one. It's the word I'm. This is a bit of a shorter one. Do you know what this one is? So this is contraction, we've made it shorter. And this is I am. So you could say, I am hungry or contraction I'm hungry okay so that's that one okay let's have a look at so you can put some down that, that we can see maybe okay like that um let's have a look at this one. Oh, this is a long one is it now this is this one tricky you've okay so that one is we can see a root word there that means a, a word which is in there somewhere which is still in another word you you've have i'll say so the contraction is you've we made you have shorter so you have annoyed me or you could say you've annoyed me okay hopefully you don't you don't have to do that okay so we've got quite a few contractions there okay we've got a few popping up there so we can see i'll we've got uh, your you are couldn't they'll okay they'll Make sure we can just see those. I'll just do that, do it like that. That's a bit easier, isn't it? And we join them together. Look at that, so nice. Okay, let's have a look at a few more. So we've got he's. Now that's the contraction because what we have done there, we shorten the word, certain words. So do you know what the, these are? So this is he. Is now this is a bit of an interesting one because it could be he is or he has. So you could say he has a dog or he's a dog, or you could say he is six years old 
or you could say he's six years old. Okay, so let's put that one there. So that one, you've got to be careful because you can use that in different ways. Okay, let's go to this one. We got the word don't. So again, this is a contraction. We've made it shorter by, by joining two words. Do you know what this one is? So this one is do, well done, and do not. Okay, so don't. Yeah, so do not shout out, or as many teachers say, don't shout out. Same thing, okay? So, contraction is when we make it shorter, okay? A bit like a haircut, okay? So, we put that there. Let's do and the last one. Can you remember this one? Now, this one's a bit tricky, okay? Here we go. So, this one is she's. So, this is the contraction we've made it shorter by putting together two words. Do you know what this one is? So, she has, or we could say, she is. So you could say, she is my sister, or you could say, she's my sister, the contraction. This is quicker and short, the contractions. Or you could say, she has a bad leg, or you could say, she's a bad leg. Okay, so be careful with that. Okay, so they are the contractions and hopefully now you understand those, okay? You can play games with them. If you want, you could mix these up. Okay, so for instance, if I take some away like this, here we go, and you can practice these at home. What word is missing there for your? Can you remember? What is it? You are. Well done, you are, you are amazing. You're amazing, okay? Make sure we spell that you're correct, okay? So that's good. Let's go to, oh, can you remember this one? So what word is missing for this contraction? So the contraction is couldn't, but what is missing for it? So couldn't, yes. So we've got the word could not. Excellent, well done. And like you say, you can play many games at home with these. You can mix all these up and then match them. And we could do that in a few minutes. What about um, this one? So what can we guess this one is? So you've, do you remember what two words? This is the contraction because we made it shorter. Do you remember? Yes. So that is you have, okay? So somebody might say, you have a long nose or you've a long nose. Let's go to, uh, oh, this one. Okay, so we've got the contraction there is don't, do, mm, do you remember? Do not. Okay, so do not eat bad food. Don't eat bad food. We should all do that. Okay, let's do this one. This is a tricky one, I think. So the contraction is they'll. They, what is that? They will, okay? So you could say, they will sing during the football match, or you could say, they'll sing during the football match, okay? So just make sure you are doing that carefully. Like I say, we can start to stick these together like that. And you can play match-up games with, if you want at home with these. Really good, fun way of doing it, okay? Like that. Let's do a few more. Got a bit of time left. What about, oh, now this is tricky. He's, so what is this? He, there are two possible answers you could have here. I'm gonna say he is, or he has, okay? He has, okay? So we'll put that on there, okay? Doing really well. Uh, let's go, go through some more. Oh, what about this one? This is a bit of a tricky one, okay? Short one, so the I'm is the contraction. So what is it? I am, yes. I am amazing, or so you could say, I am amazing, yes. I am amazing, or I'm amazing, okay? Because it makes sense. We've just changed the words, we've shortened them, that's the contractions. What about this one? I'll, what is that one? I will, yes, 
I will do my homework. I'll do my homework. And that's the contraction where we've made it shorter, the I'll. Okay, well done. And let's do the last one. Let's see if you can remember this one. Oh, again, this is the trickiest one, I think. She's. So we know she's there. She has. Yes. So she has green eyes or she's green eyes. Or you could say she is. She is eight years old. She's eight years old. And remember that apostrophe. So these are contractions. So hopefully now you understand contractions. So have a practice. You can uh, have a look at those and play many games. You could take all the bottoms off and then match them up. Okay, so you can play many games you want. Hopefully now you understand that, and that is understanding contractions. Words which we make short. So don't, he's, your, couldn't, they'll, you've, I'm, I'll, she's. Okay, thank you for watching Kapow Our English, and please write any comments, questions, or if you enjoyed it, please write a message to say you understand it. Thank you for watching Kapow Our English.